This is a 2004 Gulfstream Crescendo. It's a 36 foot diesel pusher with two slides, powered by the CAT C7 330 horsepower engine, and it's got a little over 13,000 miles on it, which is really excellent for a 2004 model. This motorhome has a lot of great features and options. It does have the two slide outs, so although it's only 36 feet in length, it does have a lot of interior space. Let's take a walk around the outside of the coach. You'll notice here you've got the front living room slide, which is a sofa dinette super slide. This RV also has an Onan 7500 watt diesel generator. It's got dual ACs. You'll notice a large entry side patio awning. The tires on this coach are all brand new. So it's ready to hit the road and go. It also does have the satellite dish on the top. In the back here is the bedroom slide out, which is a wardrobe slide giving you plenty of room in the rear bedroom. It does have the slide out awning on it. At the very rear of the coach, you'll notice it's already set up to tow, has the tow hitch, wiring, and a heavy duty rubber mat to keep the rocks from hitting your tow vehicle. Does have the rear screen, uh, rear view monitor system. And over on the entry side, there's also large exterior storage. Let's take a look in one of these. It's actually a pass-through compartment that goes all the way to the other side. Here you can see what a large compartment this is. Fully pass-through, great for storing larger items like chairs, tables, uh, whatever you need to go. Just lots of good exterior storage in this RV. Now let's take a look inside the coach. Okay, here's the front living area. The driver's chair and command center. You've got hydraulic levelers, rear view monitor, AM FM CD stereo. Plenty of foot room and space for the front passenger. In the overhead area, you've got a sharp rather large TV center mounted. Just behind the passenger seat is a very comfortable leather rocker swivel recliner chair and then you've got the entry door just behind that. This mid-entry layout's really nice because it makes the drive a little bit quieter. Here you've got the galley area. It does have the uh, laminate wood floors. You've got a decent size stainless steel two basin sink with covers for it and then you do have the three burner range top with oven and an overhead microwave. Just behind that is the fridge freezer and a pantry cabinet. Going back to the front of the coach on the driver's side here is the large sofa dinette slide out. This sofa is a hide to bed sleeper sofa and then just behind that you have the booth dinette. So this coach is capable of sleeping up to six people. You'll also notice that there are some overhead cabinets in the large slide out for additional storage. Just behind this area you've got an additional storage, some extra cabinets, and right here in this cabinet you've got the built-in washer dryer combo unit. And following into the back, here you've got the fully enclosed bathroom, which contains the bathroom sink, the toilet, and a large shower with glass enclosure. It does have a built-in seat and also a skylight, making the bathroom very open feeling and bright. At the very rear of the coach is the bedroom. In the bedroom area 
you have the rear walk around queen bed. You'll notice there's plenty of space to walk behind it. There's some um, overhead storage at the very back. And then on the passenger side, you've got a window, a rather large window on this side, which again, just gives you a lot of light for the bedroom, making it very bright. Another large TV, additional storage drawers, and then right next to it here, you've got a four-door wardrobe cabinet for your hanging clothes with the mirrored doors on the front. And so here you have the rear bedroom area. Once again, we've got here a 2004 Gulfstream Crescendo 36-foot diesel pusher with the Cat 330 in it. This is really a clean motorhome. Again, it only has a little over 13,000 miles on it, so really has not been used very much. If you have any other questions or if you really are interested in this RV, please either email us or call us at 325-0534, and that's area code 719.